All right, we're gonna go through the stuff that I have in my pack today. This is a little bit of everything. We'll go through it individually. Uh, first off, we have the hydration bladder. Uh, it has a gel lining, actually. If you put really, really good cold water in it, it keeps it cool for like four or five hours, maybe. Uh, over here, we have two three-day packs of 3,600-calorie food bars. Uh, I'm sure it could be stretched out a little bit further if needed to be, but it would definitely get me out and going somewhere if I need to. And uh, I think around 9 or 10 4-ounce packs of water. Um, I'm not as concerned with water. Um, I'll show you why here in just a few minutes. Uh, we have some uh, off wipes. Got to keep the skeeters away. I have uh, my larger knives. Um, a camo netting. Uh, I think it's a five by six, if I'm not mistaken, in case I want to conceal. Uh, down here we have a cleaning kit, pretty compact. Um, have the pads, the solvent, a pack of assorted tips for rifle, shotgun, pistol, etc. Um, a little rolled up. Uh, this is actually a cord that I used in hunting uh, up in a tree stand, pulling my bow and whatnot up. A little strap for just whatever in case. Also, it could be used as a belt. Um, oops, sorry. These little jewels right here, these are actually straws. Uh, take a pair of pliers and uh, light them, burn them. These are actually filled with uh, frog lube. Easy, compact to carry around in case I need to clean the gun and lube it. Uh, we have uh, two lighters, a fire starter. I actually need to fill this up. This is supposed to have uh, hand sanitizer liquid. just sprays out real easily. Uh, next we have over here. These are actually makeup removal wipes, but Cleanliness is very important, so bird bath. Um, got quite a few packs of those just for little quick cleanups. Uh, sugar packs um, actually are for energy if I need it, just a little quick boost. Plus, I have some uh, coffee packs over here to the side. Uh, let's see. Um, whistle, compass. Also has a flip out magnifier and a thermometer. A um, couple of pocket knives and some pencils, which I need to put a small pad in there for, like, if I need to leave notes or make notes, whatever the case may be. Uh, binocular small set. There is also a monocular inside of this pack. The playing cards, obviously, for when we get bored. Um, the Camo Compact, uh, I've had this actually God, going on 20 years, I think, and it actually works very well. It's still good inside. Everything is, uh, and I can't get it open, um, but everything is, all the colors are still good inside. It has the mirror, uh, just again for concealment if I need to. Uh, let's see, we have the Sawyer Mini. These are good for like, I think 100,000 100, gallons. Um, they're like 19 bucks at Walmart. A little extractor. There's a straw in here plus the bag. Fill the bag up, put that, attach that to it, drip into whatever your container. Emergency blanket, a, a big must. We also have a small little portable hacksaw. Um, this also came out of my hunting pack. Um, I'm not going to fold it all the way out. Some really good, those cut through uh, trees pretty well, branches, whatnot, and such. There is also a small fine tooth blade that goes with it as well. We have a dual band ham radio with an extra battery, um, extra antenna just in case. I also have a longer one in case I want to. This one's 14 inches, just in case I need to get out a little further. 
uh, the Israeli gas mask. This one has the drinking tube as well. It's all wrapped up nice and neatly inside with the canister. Uh, there are two 4x6 tarps in there. Uh, we have the small bottle of Tylenol, little packet of tissues, extra rounds for the AR, just a small little thing of rope. I do need to get some paracord and put in here. Just haven't gotten around to that yet. First aid wise, um, assorted bandages, uh, knuckle, just regular bandages over here. Um, uh, there are some butterfly stitches in here as well. Um, can of the new skin, triple antibiotic, little tweezers, um, super glue. Everybody knows what super glue was made for. Um, some antiseptic wipes, some q tips ace bandages, um, smaller individual packets of uh, antibiotic, uh, more bandages, um, good roll of tape right here, um, cleanliness again, two small little shampoo bottles, bar of soap, another elastic bandage. This is a wind up flashlight, solar powered, also does uh, AM, FM, and picks up all the weather channels. Um, a bottle opener, I don't really know what I would need that for. Um, also in a pinch, it has a cord that goes with it um, that I can plug in right there. I don't know if you can see it, but I fold that back and you can actually plug in a cell phone and actually crank it up and give it a charge. Uh, extra. 50 extra rounds for the pistol. Um, another knife inside of here, because I don't know about you, but I love bungee cords. Bungee, bungee, whatever you want to call them. There's uh, quite a few wrapped up inside of that. I do that to keep it wrapped up in this so the, hook, the hooks don't get hung up and stuff. Uh, a wad of blue examination gloves, good for cleaning when you're cleaning your weapons, um, you know, first aid, whatever. Uh, more, more bandage and stuff, those are gauze pads. Um, down here we also have the four ice packs, just in case. There was the coffee that I mentioned, they pack in really easy and do a good job of staying out of the way. This is what I carry everything in. This is the 20, I think it's the 20 to $25 version. The, uh, the SOG bag from Walmart. I have attached a few pouches on it for extra stuff. But everything that you see right there, plus an extra set of clothing, pants and a shirt rolled up with a couple of uh, extra pair of socks and everything there fits very neatly into this pack um, with more room to spare and it rides very very well um, if you can see anything that I've missed feel free to comment below um, feel free to use any of this as suggestions for your own packs and thanks again